Our next guest sent shockwaves through the culinary world with the invention of the crow nut. The Thank crow you. nut. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> he's one of the world's greatest pastry chefs, and now he's letting us in on his secrets. That's right. Here to discuss his first cookbook and his career as a mad scientist of desserts is Chef Dominique Anzel. Welcome to Arise. Thank you. Thank you guys for having me. Okay, so you are the mastermind behind the crow nut. Did you have any idea that it would become so huge? I mean, People you know, lining up around yeah. the block to buy it. At People big, selling it on eBay. That's true. At the big we changed the menu very often. Of and it was six to eight weeks to actually do the whole new menu. So we incorporate new things on, on the menu all the time, and it was just was just one of them. What do you think it was about the cronut that made it so popular? I think that you know most most people will uh, will have will already had a, a, a croissant and or donut, and putting them together was just like something fun and new. Yeah. But how did you come up, besides being fun and new, how did you come up with the concept? Was it in a dream, <laughs> experimenting? Well, I, I was experimenting, and I worked on a recipe for actually over two months in, in order to perfect it and to make sure I have the perfect layer. It's actually not a croissant dough, but it's a very specific dough. How many okay. different recipes Wait, did you have to go over through? Over 20, yeah. 25. 20. 25 mm -hmm. recipes over mm -hmm. two months to get yeah. it right? Got you. Wow. Well, you got it right. You <laughs> so I brought little right. treats for you guys today. Okay, so Ooh. there's more. Yeah, this is the frozen small. So this is the ice cream version of a smalls. So a it is a, a marshmallow on the outside that we torch to order. It is served on a branch that's been smoked with apple wood. And inside there's a vanilla ice cream and a chocolate wafer. There's wow. An ice cream on and the we inside. serve it only to order at the bakery. You serve, why. It to, oh, you serve it only <laughs> to order at the bakery. Uh -huh. Okay. Wow. So this is a little bit hot and cold. <laughs> so that's marshmallow. That's marshmallow. And so inside you just there's ice cream. Bite into it? Is that how you, you bite eat into it? it? It might be a little bit cold. <laughs> and a little hot all together. Lola's like, I'll pass that one along. Okay, no. here we go. I'll try it. And right here on the front of the plate, you have mm. the DKA. This one right here, it stands mm. for Dominique's Cunyama. It's actually our best seller. It's this flaky caramelized croissant. And oh, we, we sell out of it every single day, like before we even close the shop. All right, this is a Dominic. Before you uh, continue, okay, shut that off really quickly. <laughs> she said so, so many questions I asked you. <laughs> All right, now this we know what this is. Now you spoke about that. Now what exactly is that again? It is like a flaky caramel ice croissant. So we layer it with butter and sugar. It's a, it's a dough layered with butter and sugar, and it's butter absolutely my sugar. favorite. I eat one every single morning. And really? how do you stay so thin? Well, you know, I work a lot. So. Okay. <laughs> Maybe I'm lucky too. <laughs> how many desserts do you this. eat throughout the day? These are the I, mornings. I, I, I actually on. don't eat that many, but I test a lot all day long. Well, you have to test it to I get have the, to. the recipe right, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wow, so what, what are you working on right now? What can you let us in on your secret oh, recipe? Right now, we you're... just released the book, mm -hmm. and the book talks about uh, inspiration, creativity, and uh, lets you, uh, gives you ideas of what you can do yourself in the kitchen, how to be creative. Do you teach us how to make a cronut in the book? There's actually a recipe for the cronut. It's not ex the exact same recipe we do at the bakery. Why? Because I want to make sure that people could reproduce the recipe at home. So it's an at-home cronut recipe. It's mm -hmm. actually um, much better and easier to do at home. I actually made it in my kitchen. Dominic, God bless you for this. <laughs> Thank you. This Thank is you amazing. For that alone. <laughs> this is Just a revelation. For this right. Wait until you try the rest. Uh -oh. Okay. There's more. This well. Okay. Where are we going now? We're going in the middle. I, we haven't I'm done this heaven. one yet. It can't get better than this. Done this. We've done this. So what are these called? Okay. This is called the Paris New York. It's a take on a French classic, the pie breast, which is a ring, a ring of cream puff with hazelnut cream. Okay. So this oh. is the Paris New York, a ring of cream puff again, but we do uh, peanut butter, chocolate, and caramel. Shut Why? Up. A little bit of the sneakers bar, like the inspiration from New York, and it is like it is. Divine. But look at it, it's so huge. This is like almost the size of our face. How, how can you can we eat get this? it, you can share it. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna share it, we're gonna cut it so we don't get too messy, get right? Small pieces okay. for you. I love cut peanut butter too, I know Shannon. this is gonna be like my favorite thing in the world. This is your dream come true. Oh my gosh. Peanut butter, chocolate, and soft caramel in the center. All oh in my. one little treat. That is amazing. I'm gonna take okay. this over here. You're, you're taking your favorite. Okay. okay. I'm going to take this little piece here if I can get it out and Go try for it. it. Shannon. For you okay, here. here we go. Here it goes. Tell me. Mm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just wonderfulness. Yeah, that's right. All wrapped up. <laughs> just wonderfulness, a word of wonderfulness. All wrapped up in one little bite. Finger mm. looking good. Mm. There you go. It's so smooth, it's not overpowering. <laughs> it's very light, it's very delicate mm. flavor, not too, not too chocolatey. Mm -hmm. And um, 
it, it is very good for the afternoon with a, with a coffee. That's Do you like time. having the power over people? <laughs> the power Fish to power. move people to such happiness with your desserts? I love having the power of making people smile. Yes. Yeah. Well, you're doing a how really you, good job. How do you Thank keep you. coming up with these creations? Like, and how do you stay innovative with all your ideas? So, you know, ideas and inspiration can come from a lot of things. I remember last year, for example, being uh, sick for the, for the winter, I actually got the flu. And mm -hmm. most of the time, I work with flavor and, and, and texture first. And uh, that time, I thought to myself, I, I had to work differently because I couldn't taste anything. I couldn't, oh. I couldn't eat and taste anything. So I had to work a different way. I had to work with presentation first and, and taste. See, that's so when you were supposed to call Lola and I to help come taste <laughs> things for you. Next time, I'll call you guys. <laughs> yes, yes. Get the flu soon, okay? <laughs> <laughs> no, <I'm kidding. laughs> that's horrible. You worked closely with Daniel Balud for many years. That's What's right. the one best advice he gave you about, um, about the culinary world and how I've, to survive? I've learned so much with Daniel Balud. He mm -hmm. was definitely a mentor for me. And uh, one of the things I've learned from him is really to con constantly push yourself to please and, and satisfy customers. All right. Well, since we're talking about satisfying okay. us, we have to taste the cronut. We haven't tasted that one yet. So this is the oh, cronut. This is a cronut that I brought for you guys. It's the official okay. one. Yes. This is a rum resin. So we change the flavor every month. Oh, oh really? We I didn't keep even one that. flavor for each month. Okay. And we try to stay seasonal and uh, and uh, play a little bit with the, with the flavors. And what's this one's? Rum and resins. Rum okay. raisin. We have to taste this one as okay. well. <laughs> you guys ready? <laughs> Thank you. It's a tough job. Yeah. You know, Dominique, someone. I'm All sorry. right. See you later. <laughs> Hey! <laughs> I've never seen a pregnant woman run so fast. <laughs> she was out of here. <laughs> I just saw smoke in the back. <laughs> okay, let me grab mine before she runs. Let me oh, get you a little share. piece. This is horrible. See how I get treated? Here. Oh, a little piece of the I don't corner. think you can share this. <laughs> While she's holding back the desserts. Really? Seriously? This, this is so much. No, here. Okay. I'm kidding. Thank there you. you. Go. Tell us where we can get the book. I'm taking this one. Where can we get the book, Dominique? So we can, we can get the book on Amazon or any uh, bookstores. Mm. It's uh, available everywhere. And this is heaven. Thank you, so oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Heaven in a book. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank, thank you. you. Thank, thank you, Dominique. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Thank you. You're watching Arise Entertainment 360. Huh? Ha, 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 ha.